Hi guys, thank you so much for joining me. I am Dr. Linda Kramer. Okay, those of you who know me, I love doing random acts of kindness. You know, hugging a stranger, even just smiling at a stranger can mean so much, right? So I want to share something that happened to me only last week. I went to my local park with my daughter and I'm going to explain it in photos because I took some photos on the day, okay? So on that, I'm just going to share my screen and I'll tell you a little story about random acts of kindness. Okay, here we go. So this is called Baron Bar. It's, it's a big park. It's about five acres. Oh, bigger than that, actually. I don't know how many acres it is, but it's got a three kilometer walking track that goes all around the different lakes so I know my photos are blurry guys and I do apologize because I've made them bigger so you can see them right but the, here on my screen this is all water and it goes under a little footbridge okay so that's the first photo as we're going around then as we're traveling around we see more trees more water it's actually quite stunning here, okay? And here's one of the bridges. There's about six bridges as you walk around, okay? So it is made extremely professional, this park, okay? It's out at the, it's called Berenbar Wetlands, okay? South of Brisbane. So we're walking around and as myself and my daughter are walking and we're admiring the water views and the pelicans and the ducks and the geese and the swans, because there's heaps of swans here as well. We're walking around and we, in the middle of nowhere, off the track, we see this little thing set up. And I thought, what's this? I'm going to go down and have a look. So as I got closer, um, it's called the Moving with Kindness initiative now please apologize for my photo it is blurry and I do apologize for that because it's, it's a small photo that I've enlarged okay so on this it says moving with kindness initiative take a rock for inspiration share a rock for motivation or leave a rock to help our initiative grow Wow, how gorgeous is this? So this is just a box of rocks, right? So it says take one, share one, leave one. And it's the Community Kindness Garden, okay? So here, that's the Community Kindness Garden written there. Be the reason others smile or someone smiles. Be the reason someone smiles, okay? So here on this little placard, it's got at the top, moving with kindness initiative, take a rock for inspiration, share a rock for motivation, or leave a rock to help our initiative grow. And it's got three rocks here. And the first one says, take one. This middle one says, share one. And this one says, leave one. So me and my daughter, guess what she wanted to do? My daughter went and picked up some nice rocks from around the area. Look, it's beautiful here. It's right, look, that's all water. Up the back here behind, you can see all the water up the back. It's a beautiful wetlands. And these are all painted rocks. So my daughter brought a couple home and she put some new ones in there for somebody else. So here on this white little placard, I just want to share this with you. It says, this space was created to make people smile and to promote kindness within our community. There will always be someone fighting a battle we know nothing about. Let's spread kindness, one rock at a time, and we can make a difference. And down the bottom, it's got hashtag, we rise by lifting others. And the other one says, hashtag moving with kindness. Now, I'm going to put those two hashtags on my video. So if you are on Facebook, you can search those. They're probably also on um, Instagram and all the other socials as well. So when you go in there, go to your hashtags or just put in into um, Facebook, Moving With Kindness Initiative, because we have to seriously, guys, 
make this happen for everybody. You know, as it says, we don't know the hidden battles others are fighting. You know, everyone's looking fine, but we don't know their inner griefs and turmoils that they are facing. So this is why random acts of kindness are so important. Do something for someone else when they don't know it was you. In my um, glove box of my car, I actually keep little post-it notes, these type, little notes. So I have these in my, and as you can see, I tear them off. And I put little notes on here and I put them under people's windscreens. So if I see somebody getting out, you know, imagine a lady, this is one Monday I did, a lady was in a car park and she had two young little kids and she was struggling getting the first one into the stroller and then she got the baby out, put the baby in last. So the other one was, you know, like the two-year-old was in the stroller and then the, the baby was in the stroller and she was struggling. And I thought, you know what, I wonder if she ever gets told how gorgeous she is. So I wrote on this little piece of paper and I said, you're gorgeous. I don't know. I said, I don't know you, but you are gorgeous. She would have come back to a car, seen a little piece of paper. I don't know you, but you are gorgeous. She may have thought I was a stalker. Gone home thinking, oh, someone's watching me. <laughs> I need to call the police. But I hope that she recognises that it's just somebody appreciating her, right? So yeah, I like putting appreciated on that. I don't know you, but I just want you to know you're appreciated. So I get these little, you know, these are like 50 cents in the cheap shops, the dollar stores, little posts. I like having these in the, because then if you're in a car accident or something, you can put your details on there and give them to the other driver, right? So it's nice always to have a, a pen and paper in the car. So I like putting little notes on other people's windscreens when they don't know and they come back and they think, oh, God, did I get a ticket? And it's just a nice little message to say how nice they are. That costs me nothing and it might make somebody else feel really special for the day. So I love doing my little random acts of kindness. So, of course, I've shared this today with you because this is amazing work that these people are doing, you know. I can't tell you just how important it is at this point to get off our butts and really go out there and make a difference to somebody. And it always starts with ourselves, right? It always starts with ourselves. So let me just go back into here because I just really want to show you this one. This one is what I want to show you, okay? When we go, whoops. Come back to here. Now I can share screen because I've got the right slide now. So here it is. It says, take one, share one, leave one. My God. And down the bottom, do you see what's written down there? Laugh, love, happiness. Oh, I can't tell you. When I saw this, the moving, for, um, moving with kindness initiative, when I saw this, I can't tell you how much my heart missed a beat. It's so refreshing when I see the work other people do. I don't know who they are, but they're out there. It's like Batman. If you believe in Batman, he's out there, but we never see him, right? So how about you take a step out of this book, do something nice for somebody else, and then go home and see how good it makes you feel as well. It's an incentive to do it again, I tell you, because it's so rewarding when nobody knows it was you. <laughs> i got to do something today for someone. And it all could be just by smiling at them. So, guys, on that note, I hope that you've liked what I found at the park. And I'll talk to you all soon. Have a great day, guys. All right. Love you all. And I'll talk soon. Bye.